Okay, sometimes we have a problem with uh, the BIOS and you're not able to read your serial ATA or your SATA drives on your motherboard. Well, you need to have a way to boot into that so you can flash in BIOS. But this is going to be a short tutorial how to do it. Normally when you download your BIOS, if this is the files you get and they have a section here you can load it into DOS well if you want to run DOS from your BIOS your USB jump drive you have to be able to format it in such a way that it will have that now Windows has this MS DOS startup disk disabled, so you can't do that here. There's a program online called Rufus. Rufus dot a k e o dot i e, and it's a free program, and you can make it into a DOS bootable software. Now I'll go back to my screen here. Here's Rufus. You don't even have to install it. Once you download it, click on it, this pops up. Now you want to make sure you select your the one that you have and leave it on free DOS. Once you have it on free DOS, you can do the IS, ISO image in MS DOS. You do free DOS, it'll pick DOS, it's going to boot it up. Once you do that, you can tell it to start. You can even change the label here to DOS if you want. And tell it to start. Once this is done, the only thing you have left to do is copy the uh, files. Let me tell this to close. I'll open this. And you see that it's got this these files here. So all you have to do now is copy these three files, folders. And you paste it in your root directory of your USB flash drive. Now, the next video I show you, it's going to show you how it's going to look when you do it. Okay, so I just showed you how to make the tutorial for the jump drive. This computer is not reading the serial ATA hard drives, it's not reading the CD-ROM, so I was going to flash the BIOS, and now that you know you know how to do that for your USB drive, turn the computer on, should be right into it, free DOS kernel, okay, so we're using the USB drive and we want to go to I just typed in DIR which means directory, it's going to show you the directory of this so we want to type in CD and you hit the space bar DOS type in DIR again and you want to type in flash you don't have to type in the dot bat, it'll automatically do that on its own. Okay, so this here is should be programming the BIOS right now. After it gets done with this, you're supposed to be able to restart the computer and all you have to do is tell it to save and exit so it'll save it into 
the EE palm on the motherboard which is like memory for the motherboard already built into it so let's see what happens it's right in the flash, it's already erased it after this is done I'll show you what it says okay so it's got done so I'm just going to turn the computer off I'm going to remove the jump drive I'm going to turn the computer back on after you hear the beep okay and you're going to hit hit delete load default settings tell it ok save and exit ok thanks for watching i hope this helped you out i'll see you next time